What is good everybody and welcome back to another My Damn Toys video. Today I have a very special review for you guys and it is of the official MDT Championship replica made completely out of cardboard right here. I used um, my WWE Championship replica autographed by Jeff Hardy for scaling purposes and all of that good jazz. I have been updating my story showing you guys the progress as I have went through it. And um, as of just about 10 minutes ago, I finally got it completely done. I'm going to take you all the way through the belt, let you know the materials and everything needed. I want to give a special shout out to Dropkick Customs. He is my boy that um, inspired me to do this. He uh, makes other championship replicas on Instagram, and he really inspired me to create this belt. So I hope this uh, video is informal for you guys, maybe to help you build your own championship uh, right here. This is my inspiration. Um, this is the MDT Championship in figure form. This is the uh, top prize on MDT Live and in MDT Wrestling, you know, the pick fed. So this is what I wanted to bring to life. Um, this belt was made by Showstopper Custom Figs, and I brought him the original design, and he totally hooked it up. It looks absolutely amazing. It's made, obviously, off of the championship spinner, and um, so I wanted to make it in, uh, like, life size, and obviously... Um, I don't have the money right now to get an official replica, you know, a medal and stuff like the WWE title here. So I made it out of complete cardboard and stuff like that. Huge shout out to my brother and my beautiful, amazing wife for helping me with this. We have been in the kitchen grinding for hours on this thing and it totally looks amazing. I'm very happy with it. So let's go ahead and get into this review. Alright guys, starting out with the strap right here. What we did was take my WWE Championship replica right here and then we laid it across this massive box that we had. We outlined it and then we cut out the shape. So that is how we got the box in the right shape of the strap. Then we came back with white duct tape from Dollar Tree and we just wrapped it around as many times as possible to get it all covered. We wanted to keep it in straight lines. I think we did two coats so that it wouldn't be see-through. It would give it a nice uh, white full effect. Then my brother came in and did an amazing job and he uh, drew the entire zebra print pattern. So that is how we got that on there and then I colored it in of course with my wife. We both got in there, tag teamed it and got it all knocked out. Um, starting with the first plate right here. We used some cardboard, and then after I cut out the shape of the cardboard, I took a piece of poster board, like not the thick, thick kind, but just the semi-thick kind, and we drew this design on there, and then we colored it with gold Sharpie, silver Sharpie on the edges, lined it with the adhesive gemstones from Hobby Lobby, put that little triangle design, and then added the blue jewels with the pink jewels to match the figure belt right here, and this is what the real plate looks like on the WWE Championship. So we wanted to replicate that as close as possible. That's why you have MDT right here. And then moving into the next side plate, guys, we have this one right here. If you want to look at the official, this is what it looks like. It says Mun Night Raw with the lock, but I wanted to do My Damn Toys, so we have My Damn Toys right there. I didn't want to do the um, sparkly on the bottom. I wanted to keep both of the uh, side plates the same, so we have sparkles at the top and then um, black at the bottom. And this is the MDT Live logo because this championship is exclusive to MDT Live in the pick fed. And of course you know that if you watch the show. But um, I hand drew that logo and then I colored it with Sharpies. And I really like the way it looks. I think it came out really good. We have the blue gemstones on there. Uh, adhesive stones all the way around again. And I think it looks really awesome. I'm very happy with the way it came out. Um, this is the uh, figure belt version. If I can get this to focus... So there you go, right there you see the MDT Live logo. So that is what we tried to replicate here on the uh, official cardboard um, MDT Championship. Going into the middle plate, this one probably took the most time, but I'm very happy with the way it came out. Um, same thing that we did with these over here. We took the, um, I took this plate off the title, put it on a uh, piece of cardboard, cut out the shape, then did the same thing with the thin poster board, cut out the same shape, placed it on top of here, um, the champ part right here, if you can see, it's leveled. That way it's uh, 3D, like the real title. I took some poster board, um, the thicker kind this time, and placed that on there. Then proceeded with the thinner to put on top of here so we could draw the champ. And then my wife uh, studded it up right here. And I love the way that looks. I think it came out really great. Um, not the exact font, but um, it was the best I could do. And I'm happy with the way it turned out. Here's a little um, mix match right there. Um, we added the jewels, added some gold paint to get this kind of effect right here. And then, of course, I hand drew the eagle, added the details to that, put the jewel on the eye, 
And then for the center part, I just took a piece of uh, poster board. My brother drew the MDT on there and then we painted it up and stuck it in the middle. Really happy with the way that turned out. Very, very satisfied with the middle plate. And coming over here, guys, this is my favorite side plate. I love the way this came out. Um, I hand drew the MDT on there, then my wife studded it up. We did the same thing on the other side with the, um, you know, the jewels all around. My brother drew this uh, world logo, then I colored it. We added champion at the bottom, and I really, really love the way this came out. It really pops off the title belt. So um, this is my favorite side plate, hands down. Even though the MDT Live logo looks good over here, I just love the way the MDT font with the world looks so good over here. And then, of course, you've seen this exact side plate from the other side. So I am very happy with the overall championship. I think everything turned out really, really nicely. I think uh, everybody that helped on this effort was amazing. I think it really came out great. Tell me, guys, what you guys think down below. Um, I plan on doing a video in the future showing step-by-step -step how to do this. I think I'm going to make the Elite Championship next from Vindication. So um, if you guys are interested in that, please let me know down below. I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Do you think we did a good job of replicating this title in real life? Um, again, here's a shot of the figure belt. I think it looks pretty dang nice. I love both of them. Cannot wait to hang it up in the, uh, the figure room. But thank you guys so much for watching. Subscribe for more epic WWE and WWE figure related videos. And I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you so much.